Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video. I'm Charlotte, thank you so much for stopping by. I hope you're all having a lovely, lovely day. I do lots of makeup content on this channel, so if you love hauls, reviews, swatches and unboxings, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and also switch on that notification bell so that you're updated of every time I upload. So today, I've got quite an exciting video. I must admit, um, I think it's too early for Christmas. I'm not, I'm not a massive Christmas person but I do love the Christmas makeup sets that come out. My hair feels really funny, what's that doing? I do love the Christmas makeup sets that come out. Um, Christmas for me, very stressful time. If you work in food retail, then you know what it's like and it's in the farm shop. So at Christmas, as you can imagine, it is absolutely bananas. So Christmas is a very stressful time. However, like I said, Christmas makeup sets, I love and I don't usually, I haven't really bought a makeup advent calendar in ages, but now I have to channel you guys, I have an excuse to let myself buy them. I know that's really bad, but when I saw this, I couldn't help but get it. I have got two other makeup calendars that I am waiting to unbox as well, but this is the one that I'm most excited about and I just wanted to open. And this is the Makeup Revolutions times Friends Christmas, 12 Days of Christmas advent calendar. I am so excited to have my hands on this. Um, as soon as I saw it on the Revolution website I did have to pick it up and I've been waiting a few days for it but I'm really pleased that I've got it. As you can see this is like a cardboard box. It's not very thick. So this retails for £40 which I know is kind of kind of pricey but you can get discount codes with Makeup Revolution and they all have always got sales on, especially when we get to October and November time, there will definitely be sales on this product. You've got anyone in the family who loves makeup, it's all like younger people, friends or fans. This would be such a good present idea. So let's open it up. So we open it up and this is what it looks like on the inside. How cute is this? I love, I just love how it all looks. And all the little attention to detail. I just think it's so cute. And plus, this cardboard box it's in, you can keep it to store stuff once you've opened everything. So let's start going through. Let's start with product number one. So this is a little makeup sponge. And I don't know if you can see, it has Ross dressed as the Holiday Armadillo on the front. I actually really love these uh, Makeup Revolution sponges. From the previous um, Friends collection, I bought the sponges and I use them every day. They're some of my top sponges along with like the Cash Beauty ones and I'm so happy to have another one. It's always good to have more sponges and it's such a gorgeous little mint green colour. I highly recommend it. So that is a good first thing. I swear those are like six pounds normally. Oh! And in box number two you have a set of three little scrunchies. If you've watched my channel then you know I'm a big fan of scrunchies. I usually have one on me or near me at all times. Like, I've got one here right now, um, but I haven't owned any of the Friends scrunchies. So we've got one that says Central Perk, one that's got um, like the mirror on, and then we have one that has um, Duck and Chick on it, a little Duck and Chick. Oh, that's so cute. And I'm glad they've put like three together instead of like dotting one, two, three throughout the calendar just to fill space. I think that's definitely good. And I always need more scrunchies. I collect scrunchies, so I'm not saying <laughs> not saying no to them. In the number three box, we have a little lipstick. So I haven't actually bought any lipsticks from the previous collections, um, apart from like the lip balm. But I bought that as like a joke thing to give to my sister. But here we have. This is a really nice everyday shade. I'll just swatch it. Really, really like that shade. That is such a gorgeous autumn shade. I'm definitely going to get a lot of use out of that. And I love how the packaging of this is like the same colour as like some of the boxes. And she gives like the same colour as some of the boxes and the same colour as the makeup sponge. I don't know if that's just me being extra particular, but that's really nice. I really like that. The attention to detail put into that. So now we have number four, which is like a long in box. Ooh. Oh, and in this you get a little mini lipstick. How cute is that with the little candy canes on? So that's like a gorgeous pinky red lip gloss. So perfect for the festive season. 
So in number five, you've got this mini little setting spray. Again, look at all the little Christmas detail. It says ready to party, check. And um, I must admit, I, I sprayed this. I don't really like the smell of it. It makes me think of headaches. You know, there's a smell that just gives you headaches, but you can't name it. That's what it makes me think of. Again, you've got like matching mint packaging. And this is a little lip balm. Doesn't really smell like anything. I'm just stuck my finger in there, but it's like a lovely pinky raspberry color. Then we have number seven, which is in a very similar packaged box as number six. And this is a lip scrub. Oh, it comes in like same sort of tub, candy cane, and exact same color. And this is a little lip scrub. God, that's a very scrubby lip scrub. It smells like a sort of shampoo, I remember, though. But I'm not entirely sure, but it smells like shampoo. I oh, know that sounds weird. <laughs> not very good at describing smells. And then we have box number eight. <laughs> so in this box, we have, like, the world's tiniest little makeup bag. This actually matches the scrunchie. It's got chicken duck on it. Um, but this is definitely a throw-in-your-handbag pop a lipstick like a powder brush or something sort of little bag I have like a little makeup bag in my pan bag full of like hair bubbles and stuff like that and lip balms so that might be I might have to swap it for my little friend's one now <laughs> then we have number nine another long thin little thingy and in here we have some little makeup brushes so it looks like we've got like a little powder brush Oh, on the handles, they've got um, like lobsters on. So we've got a little make, um, powder brush. This, I would use this for passing out concealer and blending it into my foundation. Um, but a little flat brush. And then another little tiny, either like detailed, cute cut crease, eyeshadow, something you might use as concealer or like a lip brush. I must admit, little brushes like this do get on my nerves because I do like to like hold my brush as far away as possible to get like, Put the least amount of pressure on. These are cute. I have an idea. Someone that might actually need these, so this might be gifted to them. And then we have like this little square box, and I think I know what's going to be in this. I did have a sneaky peek on Revolution's website to see like what was included. And you have light shadow palette and this is called when your favorite tune comes on so this is exclusive to the box this is definitely a lot smaller than the one other ones in this palette in this palette um, that they've launched with revolution but it's a lovely it's bright it's colorful it looks like there are oh, looks like to be three mattes six shimmers which me Not my favourite sort of like mix. But those are some shimmers. If you want to see me do a look with like the palettes out this collection or any other little makeup bits, make sure you leave me a comment down below and I'll definitely make that happen. Like I'll use like the lip scrub, lip balm, everything. You can definitely make that happen. I mean, I might do it anyway. But yeah, let me know if you want to see that. And then number 11 looks very similar to number 10 and I'm pretty sure there are there is sorry another palette collection and yes here we go did this is that did somebody say party palette oh this is definitely more neutral every day however it's still only got three mattes and six shimmers so and there's two of these mattes look very similar but I mean it's, it's an advent calendar but that some of the shimmers look absolutely stunning in this palette. Um, <laughs> this is a little hand mirror. I must admit, number 12, I expect like the last day on my calendar to be something bigger, something more exciting. So a little hand mirror, as cute as this is, it's not what I was put on number 12. If it's good, but I think it probably be one of the eyeshadow palettes or something like that. But this is a really nice little mirror. But that is everything you get in this advent calendar and I think this is 100% worth the money. I think if you're a Friends fan, if you're a makeup fan, you will love 
these products in this calendar because not only do you get makeup, you get some tools for makeup, you get some like lip care, lip care things, you also get bobbles, like scrunchies, I love a scrunchie, and you get exclusive products. Comment down below, is this box worth it? Would you pick this up or have you picked it up at all? Just let me know. Also, do you want to see me do any looks with these palettes and these products from this little advent calendar? I would love to do a video if that's something that you'd be interested in. Um, also, what other advent calendars do you want to see me unbox or like Christmas little gift sets? Because I'd be more than happy to do that for you if there's something you're interested in but you just don't know if it's worth it. I will more than happy to get that up for you. Don't forget to check out my Instagram, which is Lottie underscore loves with two S's at the end. I post makeup and other little bits on there. Also, don't forget to subscribe, like, and make sure you switch on the notification bell to be updated every time I upload. I hope you all have a lovely day and I'll see you next time. Bye.